the half forward flank in the centre square line where this contest is going to go now. Edmonds brought it to the front. Villardo, if the Blues kick this, they've got nothing to go to. Blackburn through Villardo, generates the kick. Who else? Benelli B! Blackburn's game tonight belongs in a museum. The goal from the opposite forward flank seven minutes into the game when the dogs desperately needed some oxygen. And then this on an injured right foot out of a stoppage. Puts her side in front. Margin three points. 142 left. The Bulldogs in touching distance of finals. Berry, Lynch, Snell, kick wide, Vickers marks, Carlton with an opportunity for a third win of the season, Lynch marks, and it's now about control for Nathan Burke's team, Katie Lynch knows it. For the Bulldogs now, it's now holding possession, but holding smart possession, taking your full seven seconds when you have the mark. And the Blues can't afford to have anyone walking. Lee marks and needs to simply get running. You see the Carlton family's behind her on the terrace. Dangerous kick, but it simply had to be for McAvoy. Two to beat, and she'll do just that perhaps. But Lamb inserts herself like only Kirsty Lamb can and takes the ball to ground through the trudging tackle. And the Dogs are 38 ticks away. Bree Moody desperate. Off the ground hill. Walk out. A big step on Grant, and then a second one to break the ankles of Fitzgerald. Skepper keeps it in motion for Hill. Keeps it alive for Delpos. Vessio slipped forward here. Pritchard. Hill. Georgia Stathis. Is there a whistle? There, there is. is. Lala Weepy's also come up forward as well. No time to celebrate yet. And you can turn the song off as well. So Carlton can have a shot at goal after the siren. And Keely Skepper in her first AFLW season. As the song is quickly paused. 3-2 <laughs> for the season. For the 18-year-old from Shepparton United to give Carlton a walk-off win in Season 7. A miss, and the Bulldogs will be playing finals. It's footy in November for the Dogs.